Yo, what's up guys, it's Complies here. Today's video is gonna be showing you how to play on 4.3 stretch resolution, 1440 by 1080, which was previously not supported, but there has been a workaround found as shown by this post here on Reddit and from the Sentinels Apex player Peach. I will leave their links in the description below, so make sure to check them out as they are the original founders of this. I'm just making this YouTube video to get it out there a little bit more and help you guys with it. And also remember to leave a like on this video if it helps you, and don't forget to subscribe, and also follow my Twitch, where I stream Apex almost every day. The link to my other social medias will be in the description below as well, so make sure to check them out. But for now, let's get right into the video. So first, what we're gonna wanna do is create our custom resolution. And for NVIDIA users, we're gonna go into our NVIDIA control panel, go to your change resolution section, you go to customize. I already have made but i'm going to be showing you how to go through it so you're going to want to go down here create custom resolution and in your horizontal pixels you want to enter in 1440 which is the resolution we're going to be enabling then you're going to click test it'll refresh a little bit and then it'll ask you if you want to keep this resolution you click okay and that's it it'll go back and then that's it for that so i'm going to go ahead and cancel it and already have this made and if this isn't checked you're going to need to check that yourself and then you click okay now the next step we're going to do is enable full screen scaling so you go over here to adjust desktop size and position and for scaling mode you want to set that to full screen now this one depends on you little bit some people get choppy frames when they run display scaling gpu scaling is going to be a little bit more smooth but there will be just a very very slight increase in input lag which you probably won't even be able to feel but i leave mine in displays because i don't have any problems make sure you click override scaling mode set by games and programs click apply and that's it for that. So now you can exit out of your control panel and we'll go on to the AMD users. So if you're using an AMD GPU, I'm going to leave a link to this tool in the description below. It's called CRU. So once you download that, you want to open up CRU.exe. In the detailed resolutions, you click add. Once again, I already have mine made. So I'm just going to enter in 1440. And don't forget to change your refresh rate of your monitor. You enter that right here. So I have 144. I'm going to go ahead and click OK, but I already have it made. And then that's it for that part. Click OK to exit out of it. Next, what you want to do is you want to double click restart64.exe and that'll just refresh your PC so that it will recognize that new resolution that you just made. For demonstration purposes, I'm not going to be doing it because it'll stop my recording and I'll have to restart the video all over again. But yeah, you just double click that, let it run, and then you're good. So now we're going to go ahead and exit out of this. And now we're going to be finding our video config file. Now to find our video config file for Apex, you want to go down to your search bar, type in saved games, click on that, respawn, Apex, local, and here it is, video config.txt. So you want to double click on that. And the settings that we're going to be changing are these four right here default res default height full screen and no window border now your default res will probably say 1920 by 1080 i've already changed it but you're going to want to put in 1440 by 1080 and then leave your default res height at 1080 now setting dot full screen on your computer should be a one you're going to want to go ahead and set that to zero and your setting no window border is probably going to be a zero so all you have to do is set this at a one and you're done with that so you click file save now make sure to set this as read only otherwise when you open up apex and change the resolution it'll change that and it won't save this video config it'll make a new one you go ahead and click apply then okay so now we're done with that next what we're going to be doing is entering in the game property of lines for apex and to do this you go to your game library right click game properties advanced launch options and it'll be right here so once you have this open i will have the three commands in the description below you're just going to want to go ahead and copy those and then paste it right here into this line and it should come out with your letterbox aspect goal and letterbox aspects ratio building cube maps one I'm not sure exactly what these do, but they do work. So yeah, once you do that, you go ahead and hit save. So now we're going to be launching Apex. And this is important. Make sure that your desktop is still on the native res when you launch it. So go ahead and do that. We're going to launch it up. But make sure that once it launches, you stay on the loading screen where you select your server. You don't want to go past that any further. You're going to have to redo it again and reopen up the game. Yeah, game is loaded up now, still loading. Now you will still have black bars at this point right here, but what we do next is gonna change that. So you're gonna wanna go ahead and alt tab out, go back into your NVIDIA control panel. And once this loads up, go to change resolution. And this is where you want to enable your custom resolution that you just made a little bit ago. So you go ahead and click on 1440 by 1080, click apply. Now it will look kind of ugly as of right now, just because you know, you're not in game, it's gonna look funny. So now we're gonna load back into Apex Legends, click alt, enter which will put us back into full screen mode and click continue. And boom, look at that. We're in 1440 by 1080. I'm gonna go to the settings just to show it for you. 1440 by 1080. Now it is currently a little bit buggy with the textures. Like look at the shadows on right side. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys here. Like, yeah, <laughs> I'm not really sure what that is right there. Not all of them are bugged, but some of them do have a weird shadow on their face. So real quick, I'm just gonna load into a firing range and show you what it looks like. Yeah, here you go guys, 1440 by 1080. I've really missed this as I've played this res on so many other games. It's honestly just so good. Now, like I said at the beginning of this video, I don't think that this can get you banned. However, we're still waiting on confirmation from developers. 
but you should be okay. But if anything happens, please don't blame me. Um, another thing is that once you go into this and you load it up with 1440 by 1080, you cannot alt tab or otherwise you'll have to close out the game and restart the process all again with opening it up, changing resolutions and tabbing back into the game and hitting alt enter. So yeah, just make sure that you stay focused in on the game and don't click out of it. But yeah, that's going to be it for me. Remember that if this helps you, please leave a like and subscribe and also a comment saying that it worked for you as this helps me out a ton. Also, don't forget to follow my Twitch. I'll be streaming Apex later, playing in this beautiful res. So yeah, be sure to check that out as well. Anyways, thanks for watching the video. I hope you liked it and hope you all have a great rest of your day. Peace.